In this tutorial, you will learn how to use DALI on your mid-journey images to achieve the following. Extend your landscapes by adding more pixels to them, expand the backgrounds on your character designs, and in this way increasing the size of your images. The DALI Outpainting tool uses AI to understand your images and image styles and outpaint them. In other words, it allows you to extend your images. By the end of this video, you'll be able to get from this image, fully created in mid-journey, to this image, outpainted using DALI. I'll address some simple considerations which you need to have when working with both landscapes and character backgrounds. I won't go into the details of how DALI works and the basics of the outpainting tool since I covered these in the previous video. Link should pop up in your top right corner and is down in the description as well. When outpainting, you want to place your generation frame half inside the image and half outside the image. This is because DALI will identify your image and style from that 50% that you have overlapping with your original image. Otherwise, you receive completely unrelated outpainting results similar to this one, which is not what we want to achieve here. Type in the prompt box the general idea of your image, which in my case is Cyberpunk City Landscape. At this point, you'll be presented with four options. Decide which one you like best and fits well within the context of your image. Keep repeating this process and extend your images in the directions where you want to see more detail. In my case, that is upwards and then to the right. If none of the generated images are to your liking, you can always click cancel and rerun your prompts. But keep in mind that each generation costs one credit and you start with 50 free credits for a new account. This generation that I'm currently performing on the screen didn't fit the larger context of the image at all. You can see that the cyan color featured right above the generation box just cuts off randomly. This happened because I didn't overlap the top of the generation box with the cyan color, so DALI had no references as to the color existing. You can see my new generation box included the cyan color, so DALI was aware of its existence and produced more fitting variations. Unfortunately, that did cost me an extra variation to fill the bottom right corner, but the results were much better. So what are the end results in terms of image size? You can see my image went from 2304 by 1536 to 2816 by 2048, which is great because the image increased by about 10 to 15% in size without sacrificing the quality. A few points of consideration and the downsides of using this method is that at times, like in this example, if you pay close attention you can spot small differences in the color of the original mid-journey image and the DALI generated frames. This is not always the case and is less prominent with brighter colors. You can observe this by looking at the brighter areas at the top and compare those to the darker areas on the right side. Another interesting use of the outpainting tool is to generate highly detailed character portraits with Midjourney and then outpaint the backgrounds, like I've done here. This allows Midjourney to create detailed character portraits because the character takes up most of your canvas. Unlike in our previous example, here there are no prominent lines showing color inconsistencies. Again, this is due to the brighter colors of this composition. But another thing becomes apparent. DALI is not as detailed in outpainting as Midjourney is in its image generation. As you can see based on the left side of our composition where it looks a lot more painterly and loose compared to the background in our original image on the right side. Before the final tip, if you found this useful please like and subscribe as it helps the channel a lot. If you use Midjourney for extending a character portrait, try to have your character centered as DALI won't be able to correctly replicate and complete your character design, and the outpainting area will be extremely obvious as you can see here. This is why I was forced to extend my image only to the left side, where the border of the image is only the background and not the character itself. I hope you have a fantastic day and I'll see you in the next one.